Hi, welcome to another episode of Cinema at Home. The idea behind the series is to help you bring home the cinema experience without any fuss. I've got a team of experts from What Hi-Fi magazine and Dolby, the masters of audio, working behind the scenes with me to help you understand home theatre and change your entertainment experience forever. Today, we're going to take a close look at your set-top box. That's right, just because you have an HD box connected to your TV, it doesn't mean you're getting the full HD experience. Now, we talked about this earlier in the series, but just for emphasis, most popular channels like Star Plus, Sony, Z and all big sports channels have HD feeds. And these come with Dolby Surround Sound encoded. And you'll see the little logo on your screen when you select the channel. That means you really must have the set-top box connected to a home theatre system to immerse yourself into the HD experience. Take my word for it or have a listen at a store if you like. But surround sound makes your favourite serial feel like a movie and transports you inside the stadium like never before when watching your favourite sporting event. So what's the easiest way to do this? Depending on who supplied your STV, it should have a HDMI port as well as an optical audio or coaxial digital audio port at the back. Click the link below to check out our video on the various connectivity ports used in home theatre. Connect the STV to your TV using the HDMI port and use either the coaxial audio or the optical audio port to connect the set top box to your AV receiver to get the full Dolby surround sound experience. Now, if you've taken our advice and got the system up and running, tell us what you thought of the new fully HD viewing experience. Drop us a line on Facebook or Twitter and come back next week for the next installment of our guide to home theatre. Also remember to click the link and subscribe to our channel to be updated every time we put a new video out. Till next week guys, it's ciao for now.